guys, it's Di from Be Mommy With Style and today we're gonna do a little day in the life vlog. So, um, we are getting ready to head out to go to yoga and both girls are home today. I know summer camps this week or anything like that so they're gonna go to the kids care at the gym today. So that's kind of the main thing we have going on this week is my gym stuff. It's gonna be a nice light week which is gonna be fun. For a preschool at home, I keep calling it preschool at home. For summer learning at home, we're gonna be doing learning activities and you'll see a separate vlog for that which will probably air tomorrow just depending on how many like day in the lifestyle vlogs I do. Which is the next thing I was gonna talk to you guys about because um, it's another change, it's another thing for me to do. Um, but you guys on here shouldn't see any effects other than possibly positive for a lot of you guys. So recently the girls have been wanting to use their cameras to do their own videos a lot more and they've been wanting to do like the toy play videos and Bella did a little Palace Pets talking video and they're wanting to upload those to YouTube. And I don't mind doing like the hauls and occasionally like the videos on my channel. And but practically at this point we have enough videos that they have filmed and that they're wanting to upload to YouTube to basically fill up like weeks worth of time of nothing but them talking. It's really cute. It's like, you know, that showing their collections of stuff and things like that and so I sat down with my husband I was like you know they're, they're either gonna take over my channel <laughs> being mom was sad they're literally just gonna take it over or what are we gonna do here so we made the decision that we will let them have their own channel where they can put all that kind of stuff but all of the like daily vlogs like this type of thing are gonna stay on this channel so pretty much you guys won't notice any difference except for like I said maybe a positive for a lot of you that um, did tune in for like the vacation vlogs and the day in the life vlogs and hauls and grocery hauls and all that kind of stuff because all that will be the same. Um, but some of the toy review stuff and just the more like kid oriented stuff where they're actually vlogging, I'm going to pull over onto their channel. So I guess this will be like their official announcement today so that my kids are venturing out on their own um, and I'm basically managing it for them and doing all their editing and everything. But their channel is going to be I in Toy Reviews and this was the name that was picked. My husband had the final pick decision out of all the names we were thinking about and I'll put the link down below because they just have like that long string of characters. They don't have a custom URL yet. Um, but So I'll put their link down below. If you have kids that want to watch, feel free to comment and subscribe and give them some thumbs up because they're really excited about it. Um, but we decided on that name because I was leaning towards being Isabella and Natalie with style and my husband was like, no, just no, just let them have their own thing and make it simple and just, you know, just keep it simple. So um, I in, so in, it spells the word in, is kind of like a double meaning thing which we thought was fun because it's like in toys but it's also the first initial of both their names. So I in is for Isabella and Natalie. So anyhow, they're gonna be doing that, which means more editing work for me. <laughs> I swear, it's like I just like piling it on. Like, how much can I throw on my computer before it dies? Um, but it should be fun, and they're you know wanting to do more videos on their own. So I don't want to tell them like, no, I you know don't have space on my channel for this because literally you guys see how much video I put out just on my own. Um, so I really don't have the room unless I'm overloading you guys with videos. Um, so I want them to be creative and do those sorts of things because you never know what they're going to be into when they're older. I mean, this may help them in some aspect if they decide to become animators or filmmakers or anything tech related really because it's kind of, they're going to learn the cameras and if they still are into it in a while down, I can teach them the editing. So anyways, that's the kids new thing that they're doing. Check it out if you have kids that are into toys and like toy reviews. I know coming up we got a lot of like Paw Patrol and American Girl and Shopkins and Disney Lego minifigures I'm sure. So it should be a lot of fun. So anyways, back to being mommy with style. Um, now that we got that out of the way, what that means for you guys is basically kind of how my channel was two, three years ago. It's going to be more like sit down mommy vlogs, a lot more day in life. So like daily vlogs, I'm going to try to do like, like three to four times a week and then just, you know, grocery hauls or clothing hauls or whatever I have mixed in there. And the learning videos. All summer long, I'm going to be doing the summer learning videos. So that was, I, I, that's kind of why I made the decision, at least for now. I was like, with the summer learning videos and all the extra things to do with that, I don't have a spot on my channel to put all of these, you know, things that kids are wanting to do and, you know, they're having fun with it. So anyhow, check it out. 
in toy reviews and the link is down below. So we're gonna head out to yoga now and this is probably gonna be like a 20 minute vlog because I had a 10 minute monologue on the beginning. Right, I got my yoga mat stuff. You guys are ready to go play kids care? Ooh, that's a grumpy face. You wanna hold my yoga mat? No. <laughs> Natalie. <laughs> oh no, did your bracelet break? Oh no, it's okay, it's all right. That's all right, we will figure out a way to fix it or I'm sure you may end up with more Shopkins at some point because of your channel <laughs> that I just told everyone about. Are you excited about doing your own types of videos that you wanna do? Mm -hmm. Isabella also wants to do like singing videos, like she's making up her own songs and she wants to put those on there. So I'm just gonna let them be creative and do whatever they wanna do. High fives. <laughs> While being, you know, monitored and edited by mom. I think that's the safe way to go. We are back from yoga. The kids are grabbing lunch real quick. I'm gonna grab my lunch. Then we might try to go run out to Costco real quick and see if we can get some American Girl gift cards to place our order. Natalie is wearing her little powder puff rainbow. <laughs> They've been very into the powder puffs. Can, powder puff girl clips can only be blue green and pink. Blue, green, and pink. And this one, can you show me how the face changes? I'm mm -hmm. doing some art. She did this lovely art at the gym. Not they have fly. wings. These are all kinds of, they come in joys. I like butterflies. <laughs> Very nice, do you? Wonderful book, Isabella. It's a great author and illustrator there. <laughs> so we're gonna head out and go run over to Costco real quick and see if we can find some of those gift cards. My channel is gifting their channel a few American Girl items for them to review. Natalie would like to say something. Oh, thank you for kisses. <laughs> Hi. I'm gonna try when I find an American Girl card. You what? And a Powerpuff Girl card too. A Powerpuff Girl card. <laughs> They're very excited to get to talk about toys all the time. So other than that, after we get back, I'm gonna be doing a lot of laundry. We'll probably uh, play outside a little bit. Probably, maybe do like a little bit of learning stuff, but let's we'll start that generally on Tuesdays. And that's what's going on for today. So we're gonna go head over to Costco. We are at Costco and it is busy, busy, busy today. All right, we found Daddy a lunchbox. And he, he always was mine Yeah. Yep. Oh, look, so we were able to get the gift cards. They had tons of them in stock. And the cool thing about the gift cards this time is that they're two $50 gift cards instead of four $25 gift cards. But what that means then is that you can enter more of them online, which means you can buy more of them and end up saving more. So I think before when they were $25, you could do 12 gift cards, I think. And it was like $300, but now because it's $50 instead of $25, you can actually put up to $600 worth of gift cards. So, gosh, what would the math even be on that? I don't know, I'm not good at quick math. So you're paying $80 instead of 100, so you're saving $20 for each 100. You would be getting, I don't know, a massive savings. Someone do the math okay, quickly. You'd basically be saving $120, because I just did the math on my phone. So you'd be paying 480 for the gift cards and you could get $600 worth of stuff. So obviously you could do that in smaller amounts. So I got three of them to start out, but honestly when they have them, it's such a great deal. I may get some to put back, um, but um, it's basically you save 20%. And then you can also use if American Girl is having free promotions like free shipping or an additional percentage off, then it's your saving on top of that. So that's how I saved so much money getting all that Leah stuff was because I used the Costco cards and they had a percent discount out, like a code out at the same time on top of that. So I was able to use both at the same time. So then it becomes pretty That's good it. deal. As far as what we needed to do out and about, we're gonna head home, probably get something cold to drink and then figure out if we wanna play outside for a little bit and do some activities um, or what we wanna do. So, oh, I have to do laundry. Yeah, that's the big thing. <laughs> I'm gonna go home and work on laundry. So the girls are having a snack. I'm gonna put this stuff away. So this is what I got besides the gift cards. I got some strawberries. I got this lunch box for my husband. It's like expandable and supposed to be super portable. He'd like that I had like a couple different handles and everything. So he's gonna get that to use this for his work lunch, I guess, potentially. And then I also got these Philly cheesesteaks. We have these for dinner some nights, but then he also likes these to take in his lunch sometimes too. So I'm gonna get the stuff put away and then start laundry. And these are the snack cups the kids had from Costco. Still doing some art and we're gonna have some strawberries and I some, need some juice. 
We'll get the glue sticks out after you finish your strawberries, okay? So we've got these, their babysitter that was here this weekend brought these over for them to play and with and they've got different the colors. When you get the clear one. Oh, there they all go in there. Then you can't see them. I thought it was really They're cool that water. she brought them over like the same week that we just had them out. But these are, hey. I guess, Amazon brand and they're like all different sizes. So I'm definitely gonna order them from Amazon next time because the price is a little bit better than getting them from Toys R Us and they're just the same thing. So I just wanted to relay that information. Aren't they cool? These little water beads. I love these. And these are really cool, like the multicolor ones because they're so different. My husband's on his way home and we're going to make hamburgers on the grill for dinner. So I'm going to go ahead and shape them into patties. I just used the meat and put a little bit of breadcrumbs and this all-purpose seasoning in there um, just to season it a little bit. There's Natalie's powder puff stuff. And then um, I just used this thing, which we got, I think, at a grocery store, like a I don't know, a long time ago. I think we lived in the Chicagoland area when we got this, like the first time. Um, but anyways, I just put the meat on there and then I press it down and it shapes into a hamburger patty. And apparently like these ridges help it cook. So um, it seemed to work pretty well whenever you're putting a hamburger on the grill. So I'm gonna make these up real just quick. Put, like your little ball on there after you have all the seasoning on there that you need. And then you press this down all the way. And then it makes your little patty. And we like them a little bit smaller than the thing we found over time because it just is a good size for us. Those are ready to go on the grill and my dryer just buzzed so I am going to go grab my stuff out of the dryer. So that's it for the night. I always get so busy at dinner time. The burgers are really good though. So that is it for today and I will see you in another day in the life vlog very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.